crazy. And it's old. Chicho, best year of the 70s, best of the 80s, and best of the 90s for comics. Oof. Uh, best of the 90s would be 91, 92 when Valiant Comics hit the, hit the stage, or 90, 91, 92. Because Valiant Comics changed the game a fair bit. Uh, brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Best of the 80s, Chris, Chris Claremont, X-Men. So even though, you know, you got Frank Miller and stuff, but Chris uh, Claremont, X-Men. Um, I know he, he started in the 70s, like, pretty sure. Uh, but they changed the game a little bit in the 80s where it was... Oh, I got to let sell that. I'll be right, right back. I have the door closed to the sunroom because it's noisy and Sal wants to go out there. of the 70s uh, I'm a little biased because I bought in terms of comic books best of the 70s would be just because I bought some uh, what do you call it Neil Adams and the rights and house of secrets house of mystery so those were amazing those were amazing best of the 60s would have to be uh, Marvel uh, Marvel hitting the stage uh, best of the 50s would be ec comics no doubt no doubt no doubt uh, best of the 40s uh, ec comics <laughs> well best of the 40s all the horror stuff that was out there uh, and of course uh, dc uh, and timely and atlas uh, just i don't know hard to say what would you say what's the best of the 70s uh 60s 70s and 80s elder god no not elder god who asked that uh i forget who asked that oh i lost it oh there it is knights of old i was reading twitch 